So, hello guys. We have another uh what you call this a uh, review for blue sky. Her blue sky. Uh that would uh it's a Japanese animated film produced by Cloverworks and directed by Tatsuyuki Nagai written by Marie Okada and it it was released on October 11 2019 last year but it show here in the Philippines just on Wednesday uh, Jan February 12 2020 so this movie is a very long time now so we're gonna have to review it inch by inch like we do in the weathering with you so here we go first is so we're going to rate it in three categories first is plot plot it's visuals the drawings the animations whatsoever and of course delivery voice acting of the characters and how their emotion uh, drone goes in makes you cry from the moment so let's do this guys now and bear with me for this review so first is the plot of the story don't worry guys uh, for those who are watching this I'm not going to spoil you in the first section of this video if I show some warning device or uh, what they call this spoiler alert then it is time to stop watching maybe you watched something else in my channel it's very great or watch the movie so you can experience it with your own self so this the plot of this is kind of um, what you call this very bit different from all the anime movies I watch here in the Philippines uh, like the Kimenawa Silent Voice Mm, forgot how to pronounce the other one in weathering with you of course it is a different take on romance romance genre of anime so as you know in the trailer I'm showing on the background there um, there is kind of a uh, all this a uh, traveling a uh, spirit from the past of the boy who fell in love uh, who, who love uh, a Canada girl and move on as you can see it's very kind of well there the first section is kinda say this little boring for me at least no I don't know from the other watchers but because the pacing is very too too it's too slow for me 
not getting there on the point they want to build but as the plot goes no the revelation and you can feel the tension about the characters that's the who who loves that and finally uh take uh serious about what they feel so for me the plot is kind of it's no big brainer uh, it's the same odds as such as any kind of anime i watch so let's get into the next pointer of course the visual uh it, it is not kind of great i think for me no important but of course uh quotes from the animator the designer the all these all the who draw and build the characters here it's very very great um their emotions in their animations in heck even how their uh, guitar since i'm also uh i know how to uh, strum a guitar or use some kind of instrument their instrument they are sync with the quality well, the music with how they uh, animate here in the film very great and even though the you can see those in the trailer the moment they cry the moment they're uh of kind of expressions the moment they're they're seeing the moment they're use the guitar or instrument it's all been a uh, great work but of course there are some uh, minor characters no that when they do some kind of uh, animation no? or movement and i think there are lack of that no but overall the environment the background the design of the all of the characters it's been so great so far so let's get into the next factor the voice acting and this wasn't be a successful movie without these actors or actresses portraying these characters and if you look at some of you look at on those uh character reference no they have a different kind of um what you call this emotion personalities no and this voice actor really represent how this character feels how this character feel at the moment how this character uh reacts and this quietly done on their voice acting and we will, I will show you who who these main characters is being voice out so this is the the, the actors or actresses uh, that has been a great contribution from this uh, what you call this um, the movie the film it's uh, for Oi uh, is Shion Wakayama uh, Riho Roshika for Akane the second character female you can see here 
then from Koryo Yoshizawa before the Shinon the younger Shinon and of course the older Shinon who is really amazing because you are portraying a different kind of age time goddess to that then from Hin Matsudara the last actor in the picture is being portrayed by Dan Kichi Nitobe and also those uh, scene music here is very great for the music here so now what will be my overall rating for this film as you can see for me also the even though for me the visual is good voice character voice acting is great but when the plot is kind of simple for me you know uh, for me it's not going to be a 10 out of 10 overall but it doesn't go well for the uh, low average no but for me it's more than that no it's going to be uh, now 8 out of 10 for me no it's just my opinion guys no 8 out of 10 simple plot great visual voice acting is great and of course so if you want to try it out while it's or uh it's still showing on the philippine cinemas you should try it guys if you are anime lover um, you want to try uh something else or if you are uh, like a uh, musicians trying to be a uh, professional uh, this movie is for you and of course everyone else who wants to try this film so if I were you no, go check this out please go check this out and let us build the support on all the Japanese movies uh, showing here in the Philippines so they continue to be uh, shown here uh, here in our country so that's all for today folks and now let's get into the into the story we're going to be a break down so as you can see in the screen I already put in the message even under my webcam spoiler alert is now an effect so this time it's your choice to be get out of here and do whatever you can to not be here so Three, two, one. Are you not? Are you still here? Okay, your choice. So we're here in the story section of the movie. As you can see in my plot review of this, I told you that. Mm, the story the plot is quite simple but uh, because of that it also has uh, even though the story is simple it also has some lesson for us to learn like for example for sure uh, acceptance and of course 
love and family why do i think so is that is the story because that is the plot told us so uh i i think i did i pronounce the girl name right in akane no? as a uh it, it is entered by a student who is aspiring musician uh shino ne, shino as he is struggling because he wants to be a professional musician so he wants to go to the tokyo do that but unfortunately all plan didn't go well because Ayoi and Akone parents passed away in an accident. So because of that, Akone has to choose her boyfriend Shino or her sister take care of her. And because of that, Ayoi has feel like a feel burden because of what happened to her sister so because of that for class no uh it's practicing it's practicing but one day at uh, 13 years a go of Shino appeared in the hall where they're usually taking their bad practice. In a certain way of bands, you know, uh, in in their musical festival, they want to perform a session musician. Uh, is an Enka si singer. It's like a uh, here in the Philippines. It's like a uh, serenader, the kinchi. And at the same time, we, on the the kinchi, the kinchi band, Kinchino is performing on that band. And since this goes, uh, the past goes, the spirit, all that, uh, I was in love in this, you know. And as you know, the story goes far beyond that. By a call, it is very quite a simple story. But for me, it's great, it's great, it's great. So now, Ayue has to choose to accept, and he learns about how what sacrifices Akane done for her to take care of her, uh, and letting go her happiness over her that's why it's sad that's why a tear drop now so now after her I learned that uh, he need to choose to choose Akane happiness or her happiness you see is blue sky her blue sky mm. it's all internet so that's what happened the accident happened no? and 
we call this the younger self of Shinon met the older him and he tried to convince him na to to show her love again well this uh, accept your regrets accept that you still love her and that's what happened then. So for me, from all those point of view, no, it's very quite touching. And it's very anticlimactic because as you can see in the trailer, this is where the film ends. Wait, no, wait a minute, huh? Wait a minute, I'm going like this. This is where the story end in this scene where Ayue is running. Yeah, and telling herself, I'm not crying, I'm not crying. And that's the moment. He accepted is her to her blue sky is their code here the frog in the well knows nothing of the great ocean but it knows how blue the sky is it's like it's telling us the even though we have don't have kind of point of view on how large that's around us but we can still see something or someone a little perception there something good there's still something good from ah, I don't know what I'm saying right now so what do you think about this movie for all of you please comment down below your thoughts your comments about this movie share it of course thank you guys from amazing to you all bye hello guys we have to thank for all far away music for using his what is 5b opening team guitar cover check the description for his channel and the what is 5 video yeah click Thank you. February twelve, twenty twenty.